I've heard it said that a new broom sweeps well, but an old broom knows all the corners. <laughs> I know that's right. <laughs> I loved it. I loved it. It was wonderful. Everybody was committed to it. If it walks like a duck and quacks like a duck, it's a duck. Quack. I <laughs> People are really into it. It was an opportunity for everyone to open up and be themselves. Every closed eye is not asleep. I dig it. <laughs> and it was just a really exciting for me to be in there. It's been a very meaningful experience to be in this program. I think that we should all say no, 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 no. no. It felt very, very comforting to me because I said a few things that I never shared with anyone else and so it was inspiring. I met a man, a mighty, mighty good man. <laughs> They have held all this in, never talked about it, you know, and now they're willing to do that. He said to me, you tell anybody about this and you will never work in this market again. It was hard. It was really hard because it's, it's such a personal thing that happens to us. And at the, at the time that, that it happened to me, women didn't speak about it and couldn't speak about it. And I couldn't chance losing my job. I realized that that wine had probably been drugged and that I escaped being the victim of a horrible crime. The healing that came for a few of us when we realized we were not alone was so important. And I hope that this kind of thing can go on. When the young lady from Morocco, when she first told her story, I mean, she really fell apart. She was screaming, what? And I didn't know what, <laughs> it is my, uh, I was lucky that much. And we started to comfort each other in the group. So I, I, I'll say again, it was such a comforting experience. I think that, that this whole thing that's happening right now is for the best. I don't like the idea of seniors feeling like they're being babysat all day. There are more vibrant seniors, seniors that do not think of themselves as old people. This brings something out of you that can be creative and that others can benefit from and you see that and you make friends. I had never met a lot of these people. Meet with a bunch of people you never met before and somehow you end up gelling. Kate and Pat were so encouraging to everyone. To have the confidence given to you by someone that you could do it. They were great cheerleaders. I would love for younger people to see this show, men and women. We're only doing this one time, but there should be more shows like this. I really thank Wilma Theatre for having this workshop and, and the talented people that put this together. I went to talk to uh, Kate to sign up for the next series. So I'd like to do it again. <laughs>